Hello, Taurus. I'm here to do your Mars Retrograde Quickie Update. This is for Taurus Sun, Moon, and Rising. This is a Quickie Update, so it's going to be a very quick reading, okay? Keep in mind, this is also a general reading, so it will not resonate with all Tauruses, okay? So take the messages that resonates, leave the rest behind, all right? This is for Taurus Sun, Moon, and Rising. I've already meditated on your cards. I've already called in the Divine for Divine Assistance. We're going to go ahead and get started, Taurus. All right, we have the Two of Cups between you and your person. Your person has the World card. You have the Wheel of Fortune. All right, let's continue. So we have the death card between you and your person. Your person is in the three of wands. You're in the ace of wands. All right. So Taurus, it looks like there's a very, um, a very divine connection here that is going to move forward. It's going to move forward in a very solid way. Okay. Um, your person has the world card, so they are definitely ready and prepared to move to chapter two with you. And you have the will of fortune. You feel like things are going great. Things are moving in your favor and you are ready to move forward as well. All right. Your person is in the three of wands. So they're just waiting, you know, and planning, you know, for their next move with you. The death card is the energy between the two of you. And this is simply, you know, the death card is just confirming this world and will of fortune energy between the two of you. Yeah. Closing out. The old way that things were to bring in a new way all right you are being very clear with this person like you you're giving them tons and tons of clarity as to what you want how you want to move forward what you want to do you know what your intentions are so this is a very very beautiful connection from what i'm seeing thus far very beautiful i really i really don't need to clarify it but i don't want to give you a three minute reading um so i'm just going to pull up maybe another row for you All right, so this is for Taurus. So, something's telling me to keep shuffling. Something's telling me don't do this third row. So, I'm going to listen to that. And I guess we will just get a little more clear on what I'm already clear on with this reading. Tell me about the world card, please. Why does Taurus person have the world card? Why is the world card here, please? <clears throat> Your person wanted to continue to work together with you like this is it for them you know um this person they want to feed nurture uh grow this this connection like they want to they want to nurture this like this person this person is really feeling some type of way about you this card is the card of 21 the world card so this is 333 which may be significant for you all right <clears throat> Will of Fortune, why is it here for Taurus? Why is it here, please? Yeah, you're feeling very balanced with this Two of Pentacles. Holding on to this person with everything you have. Right? Yep. Coming in with a love offer. Moving forward, very balanced movement forward. Could be this offer, you might be planning to make this offer within the next week here. This person's waiting for the offer. They're waiting, they're anticipating it. See, world card, clarifying their three. They are ready. All right. 
Ace of Swords. Why is it here, please? Yeah, see? You might be planning to offer, um, to come in with an engagement offer to this person. Something that's to be celebrated. Something you've been feeling for a while. Something, you know, very solid. Very solid offer that you're coming in with. Um, you're offering this person contentment, security. Like, I feel like you're going to, I feel like you want to marry this person. I don't see any marriage cards, but very, a very solid, solid offer is coming in from you. Something to be celebrated. Um, and this person is anticipating it. Death card, why is it here? Yeah, see, you've chose a path. So, again, that's ending, you know, maybe ending the, the original path that you guys were on. Maybe it wasn't as concrete and defined, right? Chose, you two have chosen a path and you're sticking to it. This could be someone from your path, I mean, your past that you've returned to. Nonetheless, this is somebody that you want to harvest with. All the seeds that you've sown, and it doesn't necessarily have to be together, but you want to harvest with this person, you know. This is, you know, who you, this is, this is who you want to be with. You have the Eight of Pentacles working very diligently on this connection and something, you know, behind the scenes of this connection. But this is a very beautiful, beautiful, beautiful reading, Taurus. All right, so that's what I have for you. If this resonates with you, please Subscribe to the channel, hit the notification bell so you don't miss any future readings, all right? Feel free to let me know if this is your story, you know, and congratulations on a beautiful connection, all right? If it doesn't resonate with you, that's okay. Watch your moon and rising sign readings to see if there's any messages there for you. Thanks for watching.